Okay, San Bonan guys. Um, thanks for tuning in. We'll have a video later as we discuss our question three. Um, it's a question on the organic chemistry on ama physical properties wama wama compounds wama organic compounds. Um, this question three Ivela from this November two thousand and nineteen question paper. In the description below, in the description box of this video, was a tolama link amanye for my questions and one dealer for this question paper. Now, now question three, but the boiling points of five organic compounds, P, Q, R, S, and T are studied. So, sinema compound, sine column for my compounds, uh, P, Q, R, S, and T, and then sine IUPAC name for each compound. So, each compound belongs to a specific homologous series. For instance, P, Uvela from mama aldehydes, UQ, UQ, R and S, ama, ama alkanes, and then T is a alcohol. Now, with 3.1, but is defined as the term, a boiling point. 3.1, the definition for a boiling point is this one, the temperature at which the vapor pressure of a substance equals the atmospheric pressure so whenever man's a boiler or any substance you boiler the vapor pressure the pressure coming from that substance or being released by the substance it needs to be equal to the atmospheric pressure the pressure exerted by the atmosphere basically the boiling points of compounds q r and s are compared okay uh, UP is an aldehyde, QRS is what? Is an aldehyde. No, no, it's an alkane. And then UT is the alcohol. But it's just as a reason why this is a fair comparison. This is a fair comparison. Ngoba UQ, R, and S, which are the compounds in question, are belong in the same homologous series or homologous group. So this is a fair comparison. It's not fair to compare the aldehyde and the alkane. Right? Unless you don't understand the intermolecular forces for those homologous series. But if ever also study a boiling point, um, that's not a fair comparison. But a boiling point comparison between amalogans and ama Ama compounds are, are belong in the same group that calls for a fair comparison. So reason for Lana 3.2 Q R and S are my chain isomers. Now uh, well another reason is I provide a lot of my chain isomers, right? Ama chain isomers are belong in the same group, but ama isomers of each other and a container the same molecular formula same carbons same hydrogens right or until they belong in the same homologous series it's still fine as well now the boiling points of q the boiling points of q r and s are given below not necessarily in the correct order again we are back to q r and s now my boiling points were called right my boiling points were corner but the, it's fascinating over i'm a boiling points were corner agafani right agafani wa agafani and uh, what's fascinating hello uti lama compounds they have the same molecular formula same molecular mass but i'm a boiling points were corner agafani it's basically the same chemical formula as well but i'm a boiling points were corner agafani with 3.3, but we have a T, which one of the three boiling points is most likely the boiling point of compound R? Explain your answer. All right, let's study our compounds way to give. Q, una two yama branch. Two, two, uh, dimethyl butane. Um, on the second carbon in the main chain, citola, these alkyl groups ama methyl groups right so sinama branches are two who are we only have one branch who s we don't have any branches and a hexane so the hexane basically yona is over a guys is over a sort of like a long 
long chain in yana so a long chain if i were to draw a rough sketch of ilugans yam of a compound yam yelugai hexane uh, the compound will be a straight chain and then for r it's still a chain but with a branch a1 right and then this one it's a it's a long chain nama branch is i2 right i2 in fact the other branch this one komele ibela enye ibe gopi ibela right i'm just drawing ama ama rough sketches of lama compounds with lama molecules with okay now the more branched ne the more branched a, a, a molecule is the lesser the boiling point right because of there's less contact area or, or contact surface between ama lugai ama ama molecules wako and uh, it, it it calls for lesser intermolecular force strength so this now compare this branch and this one this branch and this branch this one q is more branched than ubani who are so this one has a lesser boiling point compared to this one so the longer your chain is without any branches the higher the boiling point because there's more surface area for contact between amalogans ama molecules work right so the one in anama branch definitely a boiling point is about 68 degrees because of anama branch the more branch to one is about 49,49,7 degrees celsius and then ur is our answer over in between over in between the more branched the lesser the boiling point no branches the higher the, the higher the boiling point um less uh, branches um e boiling point arc is over somewhere in between right so we answer it to like about one it's about r now 3.2 3.3.3 not 3.2 but to 3.3.3 the answer a2 is 55 degrees which is the compound r why is this so i think i gave away the answer already uh, <clears throat> in a more concise or more accurate response now <clears throat> to provide a more accurate response is not r is less branched than compound q uh, r is less branched compared to a compound bunny q and more branched than bani than s so the intermolecular forces in compound r are stronger than in compound q and weaker than in compound bani s we are gonna um the intermolecular forces in compound r now r are stronger than in r right and weaker than in compound s remember the intermolecular forces are over stronger for hexane and then lana as over weaker go q remember? so that's why it are una stronger intermolecular forces than a compound q and weaker than in compound s so therefore it's not too big i'm city therefore therefore more energy is required more energy is required to break the intermolecular forces in 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 r ne? in r more more energy is needed to 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 break the intermolecular molecular forces in compound r than in than in q right and less energy is needed or required for the intermolecular forces in r than in s so the basic idea la, is to compare ama intermolecular forces right nama branches between u q r no bani no s that's the whole idea la, about ama boiling points so next time we'll hang on a question discussing ama ama boiling points for ama compounds within the same homologous series you need to check ama branches 
you need to check a ama ama logai you need to check for the presence of ama ama branches right the more branched your molecule is the the lesser the the boiling point or the lesser the intermolecular forces the one with no branches is the one ge azo tinga or azo require more energy to break ama intermolecular forces because they are stronger when there are no branches in your molecule so 3.3 a answer you to now i guess you have 3.4 okay now with 3.4 but here a mixture of equal amounts of p and t is placed in a flask and heated to a temperature below their boiling points right below their boiling point so see tata up up and T is perfectly flask and then see a heater to a point or a temperature point below their boiling points, right? And then basically assume that no reaction or condensation takes place, but the vapor pressure produced is collected in a syringe. No reaction. So P, no T, they don't react, but after heating up, they collect the glucose, syringe. 3.4.1 which compound p or t will be present in a greater amount in the syringe okay p and t i think toilet the table again p now p aldehyde t in the alcohol right sine alcohol so si as good t ama aldehydes and ama dipole dipole uh, van der Waal forces and then basically ut unama hydrogen bonds since this is a alcohol alcohol in ama intermolecular forces are much stronger than ama aldehyde right so therefore once you see heat up little guy let me try it the substance with the weakest intermolecular forces will evaporate much more easier so which one between up and t take a guess yep yeah t up up answer to p over this is an aldehyde with weaker intermolecular forces and then ut is our alcohol with the hydrogen bonds 3.4.1 our answer is p now explain the answer to 3.4.1 by referring to the types of to the types and strengths of intermolecular forces as i've explained uh, 3.4.2 is that up is an aldehyde with dipole dipole forces while ut is an alcohol with hydrogen bonds and ama hydrogen bonds are stronger than ama dipole dipole forces so more energy is required or needed to break ama bonds gubani good t hence p collects faster in the syringe than ubani than u t because u u logai u p u evaporator much faster than u t right so 3.4.2 is the last question good num good question three uh so yeah you pay a lot of video here too thanks for tuning in guys thanks for watching um don't forget to leave a like if u tole some value out of this video now we're new to this channel please consider subscribing right in the description below is the link amanya for this question paper november 2019 thanks for watching as one another video